Good evening and welcome to Five News with me, Sean Williams. And me, Danny Sinha. Our headlines tonight. No more self-isolation if you test positive with COVID. The Prime Hello. All the remaining COVID restrictions in England, including the rule to self-isolate when you test positive, could end later this month. The Prime Minister did say they'd end for good towards the end of March, but today he said that if the encouraging trends continue, he will bring that date forward by a month. The decision has taken a lot of people by surprise, with some still nervous about what it'll mean for the spread of the virus. Julian Drucker reports. Well, when it was first announced, government-imposed self-isolation felt like a big change, didn't it? But we all seem to have got used to it over the past two years. How will it feel when it ends? We want to hear your thoughts on this, don't we, Danny? We certainly do. Yes, thanks, Sean. We want to... Now, let's go back to Julian Drucker in Westminster. Julian, this is a big announcement from the Prime Minister today. Some suggesting, though, it may be, in part, a distraction from other matters. What do you think? There's a growing backlash against footballer Kurt Zuma after footage emerged of him kicking his pet cat. The West Ham player was booed as he played last night. The RSPCA are investigating. Mark McQuillan has more on this. And Mark brings up to date what's the latest. Well, the fans' view. West Ham have taken disciplinary action, haven't they, Mark? Yeah, West Ham. Well, our chief correspondent, Tessa Chapman, has been hearing the stories of two young people and their families. Mm. And we're going to have more on this later on in the programme because I'm going to be speaking to the comedian Rory Bremner. Now, quick look at the weather. See you in a sec. Mm. Well, from acting royalty to the queen of pop, and after the Brits last night, there's only one woman who can currently lay claim to that title. Oh, yes, <laughs> Adele. Cleaned up, adding three more awards to her collection. It was also the first time there were no male and female specific categories. Ruth Littrod has all the details. <laughs> Ouch! That time for the high five now. <laughs> uh, this one, the Queen herself has approved. Campaigner and author... That is it for now. We'll see you again tomorrow at five. Claire's got the weather next. Thanks so much for watching. Good night. Bye-bye.